not just one memory, but multiple memories, is always traveling back and forth from North Dakota to Montana. Just the, the many road trips that we would do, um, the stops here and there that, that we would take along the way, um, just enjoying that, that time between him and I. Yeah, just, just the road trips, um, the, all it, showing him Montana, where I'm from, um, going to Lewis and Clark Caverns, um, hiking the trail, things like that. Yeah, I would say the, the little times would be my favorite memories with him. We went to Mississippi, and she met my, uh, my grandparents for the first time. And we just spent a lot of time together. She got to know my family that she never met before. And it was just a, a memorable moment. His, like his drive. Um, he's always looking for new things to do um, and what's best for him and I in the future. So um, his, he's taken on responsibility of, of me and of our dog Rocky and trying to do everything he can. She's very, she's very competitive, competitive, and she also supports me in everything that I do. And she always put my needs before hers, as I do her. After, so it was like our second year into our relationship, and I invited him onto our family trip to Florida. And he had already planned to go home to his family. It was during Christmas. So I was like, oh, that's fine, that's okay. But uh, when I came back, his mom and sister told me that he was crying and he knew that I was the one. Yeah, so I was like, oh my goodness, like he actually feels that way for me. So I knew right then and there. Back in 2017, when she went to Florida uh, with, her, with her parents for, for the summer, and yeah, they that first time apart from each other. And then, yeah, I missed her first two or three days. And I told my mom that day that, yeah, I think she is the one. Take a deep breath. I know I'm gonna be the one crying, but take a deep breath, we'll get through it. Smile <laughs> and have fun. Let's continue to grow together in the Lord and with each other, and let's just enjoy the moments that we have together. I love you, baby, and this is, this is it and I'm ready to take on life, the next chapter in our life, in our lives. So let's just continue to grow together and be better for each other than we are today. Today is the day my life begins. Today I become a wife. Today I become accountable to someone other than myself. Today I become accountable to you to our future, and to all the possibilities that a marriage has to offer. Today, no matter what happens, I'll be ready. I may be crying, but I'll be ready. Um, for anything and everything, to take on life, and to take on love, and uh, to take on possibility and responsibility. Um, today, Jalen Flowers, our life begins. I promise to love you unconditionally, and to be devoted to you above all others. I promise to always see the best in you, even when you can't see it yourself. I promise to be a partner in all things and to lift you up when you are down. I promise to always make you laugh and laugh together for the rest of our lives. I promise to never lose our spark and to always do the, the things that make you happy. Lastly, I promise to stand by your side, hand in hand, through whatever life throws at us. I love you and we'll see you soon. Abigail Marie, I love you so much. And first I want to say 
I will stand by you no matter what, regardless what life throws at us. I know God will lead us in the right direction. I pray for you more than I pray for myself. Thank you for the love and support you have showed me. I will continue to be faithful, honor, and respect you even when life is tough. Thank you, my queen, for always being there for me, putting my knees before yours. As we continue to grow together, let's cherish every moment that we have together, together as well. I love you, baby. Thank you. 